She's mighty, mighty, just letting it all hang out because she's a brick house. She's rocking it one pound at a time, rocking it one pound at a time, a brick house. Hashtag one pound at a time. This is the most practical bag that I could find on Amazon that was a resemblance to the next picture that I'm going to show you in this clip. This is an artificial crossbody by Woozaha, and I like it. Oh my goodness, this is the bag that I have been wanting, 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 wanting. However, my pockets and my budget just cannot afford it. But when I was going to go to California, this was the bag that I was going to go searching for. Hello everyone, it is your girl, boss lady Lexi. How are you all doing today? Welcome, welcome, welcome to a vlog from me. But this vlog is a purse um, review. This is a review, you all. Now, y'all might see me wander off and start looking around at people. But I'm in the car while they're in the Lexington Market. As you all know, I wanted that bag by Louis Vuitton that is made like this. But I just was not going to pay, you know, that kind of money, okay? So, the purse, um, I got it off of Amazon. It was $34. It came in a little bag. And I was just super duper excited about it when I got it. Um, you couldn't tell me no better. And this is the first time you all in ages... I mean, ages that um, I carried a bag that's a non-name bag. So the bag came in pieces. And it worked out for my good, to be honest with you all. But this is the strap. It's um, super long. It has the gold buckles gold hardware very sturdy and you can make it as long as you want but you know to wrap around this big body I had to you know put it to the end and it also comes with the hook where you put your little um, round circle now the round circle is bigger um, than what it is on the Louis Vuitton bag this bag is just a no name bag it doesn't have a name or anything like that but what I used it for is I put my mints in here. Um, I have my ear plugs because Alexis gave me hers since she um, got those, you know, things, those electronic things. So it's easy to close and open it. It is no problems. So I, I give this a, a good plus. The hardware on it is very sturdy. And here we go down to the next part of the bag. And it, 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 it's so simple. And I really, really want that bag. Like, really, really, really want it. But, you know, priorities come first with these teeth. You know, got to get them done. So, let me just take this off. And it's easy to take off. This is like the smaller portion of the bag. Um, inside, like, if this was a Louis Vuitton bag, it would have, like, the Louis Vuitton, and then it would have the little circle up here, and then it would say wherever it was made at, France, Paris, United States, wherever. Um, but when you open it up, it is very spacious, as you can see. I have my contact lens, credit cards, medication, and if my hair get on my nerves, my beautiful, colorful, happy little um, headband to just, you know, like take the hair um, out of my way. So that's what's in here. And I also carry my phone in this one. And it fits just perfectly. And let's just say you're just running out, right? And you don't want to carry all of, the, all of this. You know, you can just 
carry it as a clutch, you know, and keep on going. So this was well worth the money, and I see why Louis Vuitton is charging, you know, what they're charging. Now, this is uh, another part, and this is the part, another one that I really love, because you can just swing it up, and I'm surprised that it fits up my fat arm, but it does. Um, the hardware on it is just like how it is on the Louis Vuitton bag, very sturdy. You also have your little piece. Like I said, it, it doesn't have a name on it, but if it was Louis Vuitton, it would have, you know, all of the Louis Vuitton information on there. And so would it have it here, but this is just a no-name bag. It came in other colors, but I chose this color because it was like a blackish color and I could get it so I can it could be delivered Sunday which it was and the other colors um, couldn't be delivered until Monday well, let me just close let me think she got something right I'm not sure but we need just to close so we're gonna open up and let you see how big this is in the inside um, now with this one the zipper does get stuck, but I see why, because I put Alexis um, head pods in here. Because um, she didn't want to lose them unless it's a market, which I don't believe. But let me sit here and lock this door, because um, I ain't got nothing in here to protect myself. You know, so in here, it's super big, as you can see. And you can get a lot of stuff in this bag. I was able to get my cards, my business cards in here and i have my funeral home going paper um i have my perfume lipstick medic medication i also have my house keys because alexis gave them back to me while we were in the car so i'm just showing you how big and spacious this is I always carry a makeup wipe with me because I never know when, like, the makeup might get on my nerves or I just get to that point. So, I have one of these I carry. I have my hand sanitizer. You need this stuff these days. You know these days. Those days. These days. Yeah, you need it. And I just have, like, my driver's license and credit cards. Um, oh, man, I didn't even take the medicine. Um, I have the medicine here that I have to take, and I forgot to take it when I ate something, but they're coming in the car with something, so I'll taste something if they have so I can take this because, you know, a girl got to get to moving around because um, I completely forgot. And like I said, I carried my driver's license in there. And in the inside of Sayer, let me just zip this up so that you can see. Oh, this is a name. The name on the inside, like if this was Louis Vuitton, it would say again, Louis Vuitton right here. But this says Fashion Bag Fanique um, 008. So that's the maker of it. And you see how big it is. So you have like a zipper compartment right here. And you have another compartment where you can put like your credit cards, your driver's license, or whatever you need and then you can just put your personal things in here so you know if you want to go to the club or you're just rushing out to the store or something and you want to look a little fancy this is it and everything just seems to fit in here nicely you know so I would have to say for the $34 that I paid for this bag I would definitely have to say that it was well worth my $34 um, and whenever I can get that Louis Vuitton bag, it'll come. But I've never purchased a Louis Vuitton bag before, you know. And I just feel with the disabilities that I have, I have to be able to cater to, you know, accommodate what I can carry. So all of my other purses and stuff that I have, I won't be able to carry them. She's the little parking meter lady. And she is out here giving out tickets. Y'all, I'm going to have to go get in the driver's seat. And I am going to have to move this car. Because she is giving out tickets. So let me tell her, let me move over in the driver's seat. And, um, which I'm hoping that she be alright with it. Because 
um, she ain't pay. But let me get out of here, y'all. So I will come back once I put the pocketbook to show y'all how to get it back together. One moment, please. Okay, everybody, she didn't come all the way up here, but it just took me that long to get over here back to the side so that I could show you all how to put this purse back together. So we're going to start out with putting the little round circle piece. Again, um, you can put your coins, whatever it is that you need to put in there. Very lightweight. I had my wallet in here, but my wallet made it like super heavy. So I took the wallet off. So you just pinch the hardware piece like this and you just snap it on, snap it and let it go. And there you have that piece here and it turns around, which is, I think is cute. And then you add, you can add the smaller piece um, you have the hooks on the sides, the gold um, hooks on the sides to attach it. And when you go to zip up, you just hold this and, you know, zip, zip. So the hardware is pretty good. So you take your... Let me make sure I got this right now. I believe you yes. You take one piece. No, she didn't even come up here, but you know, I just had to be on the safe side. And you attach this piece to this piece of hardware. I guess this must be like the loading part. I'm not sure. So there you have that. Then you take your next piece, which is right here. And you connect this one, which I thought was crazy because I, I couldn't figure it out. But that same one hook, that's why I say this pocketbook has to be very strong. Because you take that same hook that you... You take that same hook and you attach it to this little piece here so we're gonna take that same hook push that down oh here they come and you just snap it like that and then you take One moment. I had to move because the lady was coming to give you a ticket. 